For the purpose of this demonstration, aseptic techniques were not used. To ensure that the products meet the stability claims provided on the package insert, take care to reconstitute and store under sterile conditions as instructed. In this video, we will demonstrate how to reconstitute R&D systems, lyophilized proteins, and antibodies. Unless otherwise indicated, please follow these instructions for optimal results. And be sure to wear proper personal protective equipment for your protocol. Many of our products are provided lyophilized to ensure stability during shipping and on the shelf. These products are all provided with a Certificate of Analysis, or C of A, that contains our recommended reconstitution concentration and buffer formulation. This information can be found here. To ensure optimal recovery, it is recommended to reconstitute all products to the concentrations listed with the specified buffer. R&D Systems offers a helpful reconstitution calculator at www.rndsystems.com calculators. This tool helps you easily calculate the correct volume of buffer every time. The calculator can also be found on each product-specific page. When you're ready to reconstitute, first allow both the vial and the buffer to come to room temperature. Once at room temperature, we recommend performing a quick spin in a centrifuge. This ensures that all the lyophilized pellet is in the bottom of the tube. You can lightly tap down the vial if it does not fit into the centrifuge you have available. Now you're ready to add the buffer. If you do not have the necessary buffer on hand, R&D Systems offers a ready-to-use buffer specific to your protein or antibody at www.rndsystems.com slash reconstitution buffers. Using the volume you calculated using the reconstitution calculator, slowly add the buffer to the vial to achieve the desired concentration. Gently agitate the vial to ensure thorough reconstitution of the lyophilized product. When mixing, avoid shaking, pipetting, and vortexing. This can result in protein loss or denaturation. The powder should be entirely dissolved within 15 to 30 minutes. Flakes and particulates may appear in your solution. If this happens, mix the product at room temperature for two to three hours or overnight at four degrees Celsius on a rocker platform. Your product is now ready to use. If you are not ready to use your product just yet, specific storage instructions can be found on the C of A. We recommend using polypropylene tubes and aliquotting in volumes of no less than 20 microliters and to minimize multiple freeze-thaw cycles that can damage the protein. If you have any questions or concerns regarding the reconstitution of your product, please contact R&D Systems technical support by phone or online chat.